guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install Turbo C++ on your system and how to run first program using it. So let's start the video. So guys, you can open any of your favorite browser and just search for Turbo C++ download. And here you can see the website developer inside. Just click on this link. So guys, it will redirect you to this page and here just scroll down and here you can see they have given the steps how to install Turbo C++. So what we will do, we will just click on download Turbo C++. So guys, it will redirect again to this page and it will start downloading your Turbo C++. So it's not exe file, it is a zip file. So we have to extract it. So I'm just opening this uh, zip file folder. So here you can see in my downloads folder, I have this zip file. I'm going to click on this extract all button and I'm going to extract this zip file. So guys, after extracting this zip file, we will go to this folder that is um, Turbo C3. 3.2 the extracted file and in that guys we have to go to what uh, the we have to run this setup.exe file so you can see application setup.exe so this file we have to run so you can see it is showing me preparing to install guys and now here it's showing me welcome screen so i'm going to click on next button right and now after this i have to accept the license and agreement so just simply click on i accept and click on next button and now guys here it's showing me ready to install click on install button so guys it will take a moment for installing your turbo c and guys it's done now it's showing me launch the program so i'm going to click on finish button so it will start my turbo c plus plus so guys here it's showing me few option that is full screen mode or and second option is open live example page on startup so i don't want to open live example page on startup so i'm unchecking the second option and i'm keeping the first option i want my turbo c plus plus should get open in full screen mode so i'm keeping that option and guys after that i'm going to click on this start turbo c plus plus button so guys you can see this is nothing but your turbo c plus plus screen here you can write your c c plus plus program and you can compile and run it okay so um, i'm just uh, closing all this i don't need all this so just click on this arrow button and after this guys i'm creating my new project uh, or new file so is now i'm going to create my new project so here file new and then i will be taking a new option so it will uh, create a file no name 00.cpp so here i'm going to write my code so i'm going to write a simple code which is going to print some message so for that i'm just including hash include stdio.h and after that i'm writing int main that is a main function and curly bracket and there i'm going to write clr ser which will clear my screen and then guys i'm going to write a print statement which will in my message and after that i am going to write get ch and int return zero because i have given return type as int so guys my program is done now let's save, save this program so for saving you have to go to file menu and click on save as button and guys here you have to provide name to your program so i am just giving name as hello.c and guys it will save into c drive turbo c3 bin folder if you want to change the directory you can change the directory also so hello.c is my program name i am just simply clicking on this ok button yes, i have made one mistake i have forgot to write printf i wrote print so uh, i'll quickly change it and now let's compile and run this program so to compile you can uh, simply go to this compile menu or you can press alt f9 key so there is no error in my program so it's showing me success now let's run the program so to run program you can simply go to this run menu and select this run option or you can press ctrl f9 and if you are making any changes you can save your program so by going to this file menu or by pressing f2 button okay so done guys now you can see i'm getting my output thanks for watching the line which i wrote in my print app so that's all guys it's very easy to install and use i hope you really like the video if yes don't forget to hit on like button and if you have any query you can put in comment box i will reply to your queries and guys if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel i'll see in my next video till then bye bye and take care